to. Jeff, perhaps a similar question, uh, if you may. What, what do you think some of the exciting work uh, to come? Okay, so, um, oh, sorry. Um, let me start by just saying a few things that seem obvious. Um, I think if you work as a radiologist, you're like the coyote that's already over the edge of the cliff but hasn't yet looked down, so doesn't realize there's no ground underneath him. Um, people should stop training radiologists now. It's just completely obvious that within five years, um, deep learning is going to do better than radiologists because it's going to be able to get a lot more experience. Um, it might be 10 years, but we've got plenty of radiologists already. Um, I said this at the hospital, and it didn't go down too well. But they didn't. <laughs> um, there's going to be thousands of applications of the deep learning technology we currently have, especially stuff using um, fast chips, um, to thousands of applications, and hundreds of them are going to work, and those are the ones you're going to hear about. Um, so there'll be lots of that. And I think of that now as business as usual. Take any old problem where you have to predict something, and you have a lot of data, and deep learning is probably going to make it work better than the existing techniques. Mm -hmm.